Okay, today I really don't know what the idea is. I mean, I know what we're doing. We're going to be revisiting Mera, but like, I don't really know why yet. I don't really know how this fruit would have changed in the last, um, like, update or with any of the balance changes. I do know that um, with slow swinging weapons, you can't really up tilt into Firefly Light anymore because of uh, the reduced stun on hair combos. This build is also a Devil Fruit heavy build. And for once, we aren't using Fishman, which I know is like the biggest balance change is the fact that like Fishman, you know, you can use Geppo with other fighting styles. But we're going to be going back to the classics and we're going to be using Blackleg. So, yeah, that's pretty much it. We'll talk more on it in the actual matches. Uh, let's let's get right into it. OK, let's see how this first match goes. So actually, I am pretty sure that you can actually up till into um, what's it called? Firefly light still. So that's nice. Uh, oh, he countered my thing. That sucks. We just can't let him get a Raging Whirl off under no circumstances. All right, there we go. And then we'll do this to fake out a high can, which didn't work. All right, it's fine, though. All right, and we'll do this. So, yeah, the thing about Mera, if you don't know, because I actually haven't made a Mera video in a while, which is why I felt the need to kind of make one, I guess, is, A, if you don't know, Mera's, like, my favorite Logia. Yeah. Right, it's probably one of my favorite fruit in the game. Or top three at least. Like bare minimum is top three. But oh, why would he chuck that out like that? There we go. Um But literally it just does so much damage and its skills are very satisfying to get off. And um the fruit is like the perfect like it's the best for just in my opinion for PvP and for grinding. So it's just like it's just the best fruit in the game, to be honest with you. Um and every time I make a Mera video, it's always titled, oh, like, this is my favorite fruit or something along those lines. I don't know what I'm going to title this, but uh, you you definitely, you get the idea. And we'll just do this. I don't know why I dashed instead of uh, just get going, but whatever. It's not, not that big of a deal. Oh, this is why Ito players, man. All right, we'll get out. And then we'll do this again. Man, this guy really keeps guarding my colliers. Um, GG's, I guess. But, yeah, that wraps up the first match really quick. I don't think there have been any balance changes, minor or major, to Mera in the last few updates. So, yeah. Okay. Let's see how this second match goes. I don't know why he would pull me from that far. Oh, that ice did not show up. So, also, he did not... He, did, ugh, he didn't turn on his arm in hockey. That's interesting. Oh, come on. So, it seems to me... Oh, wait, hold on. I think we can get him stuck and then make him eat every tick of this flame pillar. Oh, yes, we can. That poor guy. That sucks. That sucks. But yeah, something I do want to say is I did just check. And it seems that Mera genuinely has not had like a real balance change since update three. I checked the 4.5 logs. I checked the um, New Year logs. I checked the um, Valentine logs. Christmas update logs. Update four logs. Literally... No, no balance changes at all for Mera, um, at all. And I was very, very, like, con like confused, because I had thought, you know, that every fruit had pretty much had balance changes in the last update and a half, but, um, it didn't. I, I do remember one major balance change, well, I don't know if you can call it major, but, uh, flame flight you could do moves with flame flight back in update three they made that a thing you could do i don't know if they did anything else with that damage increases decreases but i know they did that we'll talk more about it next match okay so what i was saying about mara and the things it can do um or its balance changes i mean i don't know what i'm talking about uh mara again has not had a real balance change since update three which is definitely interesting but that leads me to my point where i think mara like i was i was thinking about it and if mara literally is like in my opinion probably the best fruit in the game and arguably the best fruit and everybody's kind of like top three you can't really argue on how good it is then i think mara is the perfect fruit all right hot take I'm aware, but like you can't really convince me otherwise. I'm not gonna lie. 
it just seems like the best fruit. Uh, I don't know how else to say it because if you think about it, it hasn't had a balance change in the last three updates and it is universally one of like just known as the best fruits. So what does that say about the fruit? That it's perfect the way it is. That it's just really good in every aspect and nobody ever talks about how overpowered it is or anything. People just agree that it's super good. So that leads me to my point. Perfect fruit. I say that as I'm getting absolutely rocked, but I'm trying to focus on commentary over gameplay. Also, he just went for that Ice Age in like the middle of nothing. So you know what? Wow, <laughs> nice. Oh, yeah, you're not getting near me. You can freeze me, but it doesn't mean... Oh, weave. All right, we'll chuck this out. All right, we'll high can too. There we go. Nope. Oh, come on, bro. All right. Okay. How much HP does this guy have? Oh my god. 1700? That's so much HP, dude. <laughs> okay, we managed to even out the stocks, but god, that's so much HP. Oh my god, his animations were bugging. I blocked, but okay. Okay, we'll check this out. There we go. Perfect. I'm really trying to focus on not losing this, this match. Oh. Alright. Oh. Okay. Okay. Come on. I'm really trying my hardest here. Well, I'm not trying my hardest, but I'm like, I'm like focusing. Um, oh no. Oh my god. Now we gotta eat this big combo. That's 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 just that's just aggravating, to be honest. And what, a Nico? Oh, a Rashman draw. Oh, it didn't connect. He switched weapons. That sucks. Um, dude, can you just, like, come here? There we go. PB. That PB was very, very good for us. All right. We'll go check this out. He panicked, it seems. Oh, wait, why? I'll take it, and we'll... we'll... All right, and there we go. That should kill, right? That should kill? That, that should kill? Perfect. I also really like the ult. The ult charges absolutely like it's just a way better Goro ult, like in every way. The only way it's not better is that its AoE is smaller, but it charges significantly faster, does more damage, and the AoE isn't even that much smaller, to be honest with you. I'm sorry I focused so much on that match and didn't talk as much. But yeah, I think that this is probably like the perfect fruit in the game. I'm not gonna lie. Okay, that's phenomenal. I already got hit by a Phoenix Burst, and he went for a Nitori Strike, but it's cool. We can just kind of make him miss it and then punish, which is always, always nice. And we'll chuck this out. We'll high can. I don't know if that high can is true, but... Oh. See what I mean? See what I mean? Too good. It's too good. All right? He rage quit. You know what's nice? I'm getting light kicked whenever you're trying to store your inventory. Anyway... Let's take a look at our, 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 comp oh, what? What, what just happened? Okay, well, it's fine. Um, he's a Pika user. I knew that. Uh, uh, I forget that. Oh, are you kidding me? That's the luckiest. Oh. Bro, what is this guy doing? How is he getting these skills off? All right, we'll chuck this out and we'll chuck this out. There we go. Why would he Geppo and then go for a pull? Yeah. Anyway, this might be the last match. If it is, I just want to say, Matt, Mera is amazing. It really is. It's genuinely fun. It's good for grinding. Uh, whoop. And it's um, great for PvP. What more could you ask for, all right? Like, it's just good in literally every sense of the word. Fun, PvP, PvE. There's not much more to fruits other than that. Alright? You know, and it's not just like grinding dungeons or anything. Leveling, it works. Has a high AoE ult that can one-shot like most quests, to be honest. It can grind Krakens and Sea Beasts because of its high range and like high damage moves like Firefly Light with low cooldowns. So, it, it really can just do it all. So, what is there to like... I cannot believe I just caught him with that. That's actually very impressive because I took—I was very slow with it. I, I stuttered a lot with that. Uh, anyway, 
I'm gonna check this out. I'm gonna check this out. Oh, wait, where is he? Ah, there he is. I want to wait to do anti until he is lower because bro is like he's a pika user so he could just fly and i don't want to do it i don't know why i don't pb that i know how i just feel nervous pbing it uh oh wait what, what what just happened what how, why did i drop that okay you know what get away from me oh that takes four times that's actually very solid yeah i had a feeling he would go for that um oh wait he's hurt wait oh okay i thought he interrupted it he didn't go for your life flight no okay and there we go that wraps up that match um i guess that's it for this video as you can see marrow is really good honestly peak fruit in this game i'm not gonna lie it's the most well-rounded some it's, it's very fun um it hasn't had a balance change in the last update and a half that says a lot about how good the fruit actually is they haven't changed it and it's not broken 